introducing my limitless belt drive drag setup for 2021 I got all the pulleys from the 45 down to a 15 to 42 40 36 35 30 25 24 20 18 15 I got all the belts from a 171 all the way up to a 210 I got a Few more belts coming, a 168, a 165, and a 162. I ordered two belts, you know, for every number, just in case I wear one out, you know, I can get another belt. I got all these different sizes, you know, just in case I want to run a 40, 42. I'm going to need a bigger belt to run that. If I run the 42, 24, I'm need something smaller or something, you know. So to see what fits and what works best with the setup. Huh. I'm new to this belt drive setup, drag race, drag racing, new to that too. So I'm new to both of these, so this will be a learning process for me. I got this uh, 40, what's this, the 5660, 5660 TP, 1460 KV. I'm going to try this motor out. Because I don't want to move my battery trays. And since that motor fit in there, that works for me. Got the XLX2, all six gauge wire, six gauge wire in the front, six gauge wire in the back. All these water wires in the back are soldered in, wires in the front soldered in. I was having problems out of my XLX2 on that car with my B bullets. So, motor kept popping out. And almost catching on fire as smoke or whatever but they kept popping out my bullets was popping out I got it on a few of my runs you can see it so I soldered them in there on that car and I ain't had a problem out of them since so I figured soldering them in there works kind of good but so I soldered these six gauges in this one this one and um, if I get good results out of it no problems they don't burn up like what's been happening to people I'm going to solder 6 gauge wires to all my XLX tubes. I got like three or four of them. So I'm going to put 6 gauge wires on all of them, all the way around, as long as this one hold up. So this is my test one. You know, I might do a speed run with this car too. You know, get a speed run out of it with the belt set up. Because so I want to see if, you know, the belts will hold up at high speeds, you know. So I'm going to probably try to take the car to about 100 115 you know somewhere around there just to see if the belts hold up you know and if they do I might convert one of my speed run cars into a belt driven speed run car so all these are like eight millimeters these are all eight millimeter pulleys you can get them in five or eight you get I got mine on eBay whole set don't really cost me hardly nothing so Mm -hmm. didn't cost that much, came from China, it took about two weeks to get here, they sent all the little, you know, things to lock them down, get all the belts, um, I put the links in the description to order these pulleys and order the belts, you know, if anybody interested in trying to set up, so I put the link in the description so y'all can, you know, you know, look them up, order them if you want them, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to get this car set up, uh, today is what the 31st yeah I'm going to try to get this car set I might work on it tonight you know because this is going to be my New Year's well, yeah my New Year's little 2021 2021 setup. so I'm going to work on it tonight get this all put together and I'll be back on you know I'll be right back alright I'm back I got the Motor on here, got the belts on here. Little three S's from me testing it just to make sure it roll, everything roll good. This motor is not a direct fit. It requires some adrenaline over here. There's a screw with a nut. The screw is on the bottom, but it connects to a nut up here that holds this front end on. You have to drill that to get this motor in there. And the little steering thing over here, it won't. It's fine now, but you got to drill that too, which, you know, messes up, I guess weakens it. So if I do crash, I'm expecting that part probably to break. 
you know, so I guess I gotta try not to crash, but you got adrenal that, uh, you got adrenal this, there's a thing on this battery tray right here that a screw go into, you got adrenal that in order for the pulley to fit, you know, but besides all that, the motor's on here, belt, so I got a 24-42 pulley, um, the HTD 186 belt, it fits good. My problem gonna be my limitless body don't fit on here, so I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep this exact setup because of that, or end up getting a GT body to put on it, or you know I'm not sure yet, but I'm just you know, going with the flow right now. But everything's on here, it runs, it works. Let's see, let's turn this on. Everything spins. These batteries are in storage mode. It's a leaf because I was just outside messing around with it. But it runs just fine. I think I like it. Might be my new little favorite car now. All because of a little belt drive. So, it's my limitless belt drive drag car for 2021. Uh, thanks for watching. I'm out.